Hey, this is Jordan. I'm doing a part two of my question and answer video here. Uh, Matt sent me a couple more questions on racing or, or running shorts and using music or listening to music while you work out. First off, both of them are, are kind of preference what, what you really want to do. As far as running shorts go, when I was in high school I ran in basketball shorts, like the really long, like down to my shin type of basketball shorts because those are kind of, you know, the cool thing I guess. But uh, since kind of getting more serious into running, I almost always run in running shorts. Um, the shorter the short is, the less drag and, 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 and uh, static you're going to get on uh, on your legs when they're rubbing against your knees or your thighs or something, something like that. So I usually, I almost always do running shorts when I'm when I'm running and doing workouts. They vary in, in lengths. I know Nike makes some longer running shorts and or uh, multiple different shorts and. It really, as far as brand goes, you know, I can't recommend any one over the other. You just kind of have to figure out which one you like the best. The nice thing about running shorts is that most of them have a liner in them, and a lot of them have the little pockets in there for keys or a gel or something like that. So definitely take a look in and, and see if you, you know, as far as comfort wise, if running shorts are for you. I definitely recommend them, and that's why I run in all the time. As far as Running it with music or headphones or iPods, I don't really use it a whole lot. When I first started running, high school or you know even after college, I didn't have an iPod, so I just didn't listen to music. So I haven't been used to it, and you know I don't think it's a bad thing. A lot of people do it, and um, it can be very motivating and help you keep a, a good tempo when you're running. But it's really preference. One thing I'd, I'd recommend or caution you on if you're going to use headphones and, and train a lot with music is a lot of races don't allow headphones for safety reasons. So if you're entering a race, you might want to check that out and make sure you can listen to music on, on race day. Because uh, if you're used to it and you go out and run and you don't have it, it might have some negative effects for you. But generally on race day, you're going to be pretty excited to have a lot of crowd support. So I've never had an issue with, with wanting to have music when I was when I was at any races. But I do listen to a lot of music when I'm on a treadmill. If I'm doing you know any running uh, of significant length on treadmills, it's boring enough as is. So I'll usually put some music on, and I actually listen to a lot of audiobooks and podcasts when I'm on the treadmill. So all in all, I guess it's, it's really preference on both the running shorts and the the music. But you just kind of have to figure out what you like best. But um, either one is really fine. So. Hopefully, again, this is helpful for you. Keep the questions coming, and um, yeah, good luck with the running. Bye.